Hi, everybody. Thank you so much for tuning in to the first Grandstand Jams. This is Kayla Green, founder of Grandstand Music Festival, and I am so excited you're here because you are about to hear a performance from the incredibly talented Compose the Way and learn more about the House of Promise. Sherry Montgomery, the founder of the House of Promise, Compose the Way, and members of the Grandstand Music Festival team will be here to answer your questions and comments in the chat. So send us messages and we'll be here at the whole watch party. But before that, I wanted to give you a little bit of background on what Grandstand is about and why we wanted to host these watch parties. We're a nonprofit that formed a little under a year ago with the mission of using music to take a stand against human trafficking. And this started as a hypothetical business plan that I created in a music class that I took at Michigan State University last year. But I really wanted to make it a reality after talking with human trafficking organizations and learning that a huge part of why this is the fastest growing crime in the world and why it is so prevalent in the United States is just because people don't know enough about how to recognize and report human trafficking when it's happening right outside our doors. And so with our first event last year in Grand Rapids, we brought together six different music groups and 13 organizations working to address human trafficking in Michigan to have an afternoon of food and eclectic music. And all of the organizations provided resource tables and speakers so that people could walk away feeling like they had heard great music and they also knew so much more about how the Grand Rapids community could reduce human trafficking where they lived. And today we were supposed to have our second live event, which was supposed to take place in Lansing to support the House of Promise. And since so many of the issues that put people at risk of human trafficking have been exacerbated by this COVID-19 outbreak, we felt like now more than ever was an important time to be spreading awareness of this issue. And we also understand that the coronavirus outbreak has caused so much exhaustion and disappointment and so many other emotions for most of us. And so our main hope with this uh, show today is just to leave you with a little bit of encouragement and feeling like you have some positivity for your day. And you're about to see a short video from the House of Promise and a full set of original tunes from Compose the Way. Grandstand wouldn't be possible, though, without the incredible team of Michigan State University students who have been helping put together Grandstand Jams. So they are here to kick it off. We love music, and we believe that it is a powerful tool that we can use to take a stand for the unheard. In the midst of the COVID-19 outbreak, this performance is dedicated to those in the community doing their part on the front lines and at home. And to the more than 25 million individuals impacted by human trafficking who are especially vulnerable during this time. Stay tuned after the performance to hear from House of Promise and how you could support them and their important work. We hope you enjoy this performance from the incredibly talented Compose the Way. Chat with us in the comments throughout and we'll be here for you to answer your questions. Thank you for tuning into Grandstand Jams and taking a stand with us for those who have been robbed of their voices by modern day slavery. I'm Sherry Montgomery, the founder of A House of Promise. The House of Promise is a safe haven for girls to come to that have been severely sexually abused or trafficked. It's a beautiful home that I can house eight to 10 girls in. It feels like a home. It's not a house, it's actually a home. You need a house like the House of Promise because they can come here and they can share their horror stories. They can share their war stories. They're normal here. I want to be a normal person with a job in a house. I have three kids also, and I want to be the mom that I wasn't. I want to be able to take them to school every day and watch them grow up. This is this hidden secret that if you want to turn your head or close your eyes, you don't have to look at it. But the reality is it's out there. It's in every community and you don't have to do what I'm doing and getting my hands dirty, but you can help the House of Promise do that. You can write a check, you can, you know, volunteer if you want, but instead of these girls being out there on the streets, help the House of Promise get them to be successful girls in society again. 
Hey everyone, my name is Jordan Davis, also known as Compose the Way, and I'm a singer-songwriter from the Metro Detroit area as well as a master's student here at Michigan State University. It is my absolute pleasure to be here today with you to perform and share some of my original music in support of a really important cause. For those of you who don't know, Grand Sand Music Festival was initially established as a way to raise awareness about human trafficking and to raise money for an organization here in Lansing called House of Promise. Due to the outbreak of COVID-19, the lives and safety of those impacted by human trafficking is at an all-time high. And as a part of Grandstand Jams, we hope to do two things. One, to enlighten you about human trafficking and to share more information about the cause, as well as to provide some relief at home during these trying times. If you want to help and are interested in supporting the organization House of Promise, there will be more information at the end of this video. Um, before I get started, I just want to say thank you so much to the Grandstand Festival team for putting this opportunity together. And thank you all so much for tuning in. Enjoy. This first song is entitled These Days.
takes time to learn the truth. Realize who's feeling who. Open up your mouth, I'm begging you. Cause I've got no time to waste, no words to lose. Next song is called Follow. Thought that 
This next song is called Daydreams. Steer 
Please feel free to stay connected with me as well as my project Compose the Way on social media. Uh, my debut album entitled Connections is streaming on all streaming platforms and is available for purchase at composetheway.bandcamp.com. Um, also, please stay connected with Grandstand Festival and House of Promise on social media. And thank you guys so much again for tuning in. Please stay home, stay safe, and thank you. Good evening. I'm Sherry Montgomery. I'm the founder of the House of Promise. 
Thank you for everybody tuning in to this concert. I hope everybody enjoyed it. Thank you for all the comments and, and questions that you had through, through this program. I'd like to give you some information on sex trafficking and give you some things to maybe walk away and think about. The students at MSU are amazing. They heard about the House of Promise and they've heard about the problem of sex trafficking in our communities and they wanted to do something about it and that's where this concert came from. Hope you tune into the other ones and hopefully we'll have even more information for you then. But right now, I think a lot of people think that sex trafficking is a third world country problem or it's girls from different countries being shipped into America and they're being trafficked here. But the reality is these are American girls being trafficked in, in the United States of America. It's our, our own girls that are being sex trafficked. The average age of a sex trafficked girl is 12 to 14 years old. Right now, we think that it's not in our communities. It's, you know, it's just maybe in big cities then. And that's really not true. A lot of victims from girls that come out of, oh, and boys, that come out of foster care fall victim to this. The, the percentages are 3% of girls that get into this are kidnapped. So like the movie Taken. Um, but 35% of girls that are sex trafficked are sold by their own family. And 62% of them are tricked into it by either a good friend or a boyfriend. So it's not, it, it's not what we think it is a lot of times. It is girls that are vulnerable, girls that are looking for someone to love them, girls that, that are looking for approval, or even, you know, there's there's girls out there. I've had girls that are 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 have master's degrees, you know, bachelor's degrees, they're highly intelligent, but they got caught up in it. It's very serious right now. And the hard part of it is that we get these girls that, that come that get caught up in this and then there's no place for them to go. Another thing I'd like to share with you is right now, sex trafficking is a $32 billion a year industry. Let me repeat that. $32 billion a year. This isn't a problem that's gonna go away tomorrow. There's big money to be made off human beings. Right now, slavery is higher in the world than it's ever been in our history. So what can we do about it? Well, one of the things that I did is I wanted, I opened a home. I opened a home for these ladies that they can come in, they can get unconditional love, they can feel safe, they can be here for two years. These girls have been on the streets so they haven't been taken care of, so we get them their, their uh, therapists, their, their psychiatrists, we get them into dental appointments, we get them into uh, medical doctors, and we just give them a safe, quiet place to heal and find who they once were again. It's a long process. These girls are very, very damaged. And especially when it's been a family member that's trafficked them, just imagine what their minds try to figure out why this has happened to them. So I hope you will tune into the other concerts that are coming up. I hope you go to our website and check us out more and see what we're all about and get more details. And thank you again. Thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this watch party. If you want to learn more about the House of Promise or if you want to donate to support their work, then you can go to their website, thehouseofpromise.com, and you can also follow them on Instagram and Facebook. And don't forget to follow Grandstand Music Festival too, because we have another watch party coming up on May 9th, and we are really excited to make announcements about that. So if you want to stay up to date, then follow us, and we hope to see you next time.